Okay. Well, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever in the world you might be. My name is Kevin Mayhem, and I am the Vice President of Sales and Marketing for Jensen Dental. And I uh, am excited to, to be joined by our friend, uh, Bart Cothran, who's a certified dental technician uh, streaming in live from Winter Springs, Florida from a brand new laboratory, Bart. It looks, uh, it looks beautiful. It's, it is a pleasure to work here. Uh, well, welcome. Uh, we are excited to spend a few minutes with you today. Um, you know, it's regarding Chicago. Your flight is booked. Your hotel is all set. So I'm sure you're excited to uh, be joining the thousands that are that are headed to Chicago in a couple of weeks. Should be fun, huh? It's going to be a great time. And it's, uh, these guys that you got coming from EO, this is like a once in a a lifetime event with all, all the talent that is coming for me. I'm, I'm really excited to watch, just go and attend the courses. Well, you know, for, for those of, of you listening to this, um, Bart is a, a very humble guy and we're excited about that lineup. But Bart, I would tell you, you're an important part of that lineup because uh, Bart has, Bart, how long have you been using Mio? Maybe about five years, four or five years. Pretty long time. Yeah. Um, Many of, of you know Bart because you travel around quite a bit. Uh, you know, you've spent a lot of last year uh, going into laboratories and, and providing education uh, on monolithic materials and MEO, even doctors as well. That's become a, a big part of what you do. And, you know, Bart, you play a really important role because I, you, you use MEO in a very efficient and an effective way. And I know you use it a lot of different ways, but you're in a production environment. Um, you're doing a lot of cases at the laboratory. Um, so I, I think you bring a, a very realistic and implementable and and you bring a level of beauty to Mio um, that really is inspiring to people. So you play a really important role in what we're doing in Chicago. Well, I appreciate that. I'm just glad to have a role. You got a role. We're uh, we're going to have Bart uh, on Friday and Saturday at our booth, um, and and I know uh, several times. So Bart, I haven't told you this. We're not going to chain you to the to the booth, but it'll be almost like that uh, because we got you there a, a number of times on Friday. I think at 11 a.m., at 2 p.m., and 4 p.m. talking about different things, and then on Saturday, 9, 12, 2, and 3. So. For all intents and purposes, don't worry. We'll give you food and water. We'll keep you. <laughs> Tell your wife we'll take good care of you. But we are excited to to spend time with you. And people like like to learn from you, Bart. You're a great educator. Um, what are some of the things that you think uh, folks could learn from spending a little time with you at your demo table in Chicago? Well, uh, I, we've talked about this in the past. Um, that everyone has a different way of learning. And my way of learning is I, I mean, I can, I can read a book, but I just, I just don't get it from, from print. Um, what, what really turned the corner for me was when I went and, and worked with Don Cornell that one day and I saw, I thought I was doing pretty good, but then I saw what he did and, and the little tips and little tricks that he used to achieve that. And I said, oh man, this is, and my work has been like a hundred percent better since that, that day, you know. So that's the thing that I want to, that I show people. Um, I've got a course I just did not long ago. Um, it was all doctors and assistants. And one of the assistants had never touched Mio in her life. And she did one of the prettiest cases with paint with the gingival um, structure I've ever seen. And, and she'd never done it before. Uh, so, and it was just after showing her, you know, how to do it. And then she just, did the same thing and it came out even better than mine. So, hmm. you know, that's, that really, that excites me. You know, when you can, when you can achieve with just a few, with a, so, such a minimal amount of material where you can achieve the aesthetic results that you would if you were layering five or six layers of, of uh, ceramic on there on, hmm. on a hybrid case. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and uh, you know, in your own lab, in, in, in the, the work that you're doing now, um, what kind of feedback do you get from the doctors regarding those uh, monolithic cases with me? They, they, will, they ask for Mio now. It used to be like at our discretion, you know, because, I mean, to them, you know, stain is stain. You know, in fact, that's the way we saw it, too, when we first bought it. You know, we were just looking for a, a, diff, a, a better way to match single anterior crowns because we, we get a lot of them. 
but now it's turned into like that's that's the aesthetic uh, department, uh, you know, in the ceramic department. Did you, so you probably saw my interview with Dominic yesterday, Dominic uh, Glenecki. And, uh, you know, it's funny be, because, it, it, you know, and I'll say it again, you know, human nature, when you see something and you're trying to figure out what it is, you tend to compare it to what you know, like what's in your world, right? What you're familiar with. And you just said it, uh, you know, I think a lot of people look at Mio and they, they, they look at it and it's, it's a paste, it's, a, it's in a jar, it's got different colors uh, and their brain says stain, but it's not. It's, it's mm. a liquid ceramic and it is an entirely new approach really to aesthetic work uh, on a monolithic canvas. And, you know, we're still learning uh, no, to use it five or six years later. So you're right. But then something clicks and you, and you get it and you realize what it is. And you, you've been in good company with learning from some others. And, and I know others will be in your company. And you can help them kind of learn that too. Uh, you, you, you like you like to think that you reason on this stuff, and I, you know, and I follow Kite's work like you wouldn't believe it. the the amazing complex cases that they do up there in Arkansas. They blow my mind. Um, mm -hmm. And for those guys, that that doctor over there, he doesn't he doesn't pinch pennies. You know, I mean, he really he really does the best. And for him to to add Mio into that lineup as being the go to material for aesthetics. That means a lot. And then you see the work that Kite's putting doing. And, and you, you know, you say, I, I need a part of that. I need to, I need to do that. Absolutely. I mean, it combines the best of both worlds, right? The durability and, and the accuracy and reproducibility of a monolithic uh, material substrate. Uh, but the beauty uh, of layered or natural teeth, uh, but it's durable. It won't chip, it won't break. And I think that's what they realized in that practice. But, you know, whether you're doing large span, uh, full arch uh, implant retain bridges or single unit uh, cases, you know, me, there's a, I think an amazing application across all of those different, uh, uh, you know, restorative options. And I know folks will be excited to, to learn from you um, at, at uh, our booth and you know you'll be able to spend a lot of time with folks there and oh I, I look forward I look forward to that because as you know that's that's what I like doing so yeah you like being with people and people like yeah. being with you I think um you know if whether they're brand new to Mio or they're interested in me or maybe they've had Mio for five years right um and don't really use it I think there's a lot that you can you can teach them and and they can take that with them uh and implement it Monday after Chicago uh, I hope so in fact, I'm, I'm sure they I'm sure they will. Yeah. Well, Bart, I, I appreciate you spending a, a few minutes uh, with us. Um, the countdown is on. Make sure you you eat your Wheaties and, and get some sleep because we will be in Chicago soon. Uh, I, I, I told you I might toss out a hard question to you. I, I, I mentioned that I'm going to take it easy on you. Today. That's good. That's good. <laughs> that's good. I appreciate yeah. that. We'll give you a hard time in Chicago, but thank you for joining us. We're excited to, to uh, have you at the booth and, and look forward to seeing you there, Bart. Well, thanks for having me, Kevin. All right. Take care. Have a great day. All right. Bye-bye.